In this video, we're going to talk about textbooks. Textbooks are not meant to be exciting. Their main purpose is to educate the reader on whatever topic they're about. Some typical elements include title, author, table of contents, chapters, glossary, and index. And as you're reading your textbook, some signals for important information include chapter headings, bold or italics, charts, pictures, vocabulary boxes on the side of the pages, and most importantly, summaries of the chapter. I'm going to go over two ways to read a textbook. The first is skimming. So you're going to read the first paragraph of the section word for word. And then for all of the following paragraphs, you're going to only read the first and last sentence word for word. For all the other sentences in between, you're just going to kind of skim and look for those bold and italics. And then you're going to read the last paragraph of the section word for word. And then always paying attention to vocabulary terms. And as you're doing this, take notes. Any type of notes work, whatever works best for you. And then also try and summarize each paragraph into one word and then always answering the question, what is the author trying to say? The second way of reading a textbook is more in depth and it's called SQR to the fourth. So you're into survey. You're going to look at the chapter to get a feel for it. And then you're going to come up with questions that arise from the heading titles. And then you're going to read the section to answer those questions. And then you're going to write down any facts or details about what you're reading and anything that comes out to you. Then after that, you're going to review your notes and summarize the main points out loud. This kind of helps make the information stick to you. And then lastly, you're going to reflect on what you read and think about how you can apply the new knowledge that you have gained into what you already know. That is all I have for you this week. If you have any questions, feel free to email.